Each and every one of Hawaii's islands is a unique destination within itself. Lush foliage, towering mountains, simmering volcanoes, cascading waterfalls, and spectacular beaches are only a small part of the Hawaii encounter. Add a culture rich in tradition to a vast assortment of historically significant sites dating from centuries ago to the not so distant past and you have a lavish tapestry woven from the different strands the individual islands represent. Tying together the islands of Hawaii, Oahu, Maui and Kauai are the two classic ocean liners of American Hawaii cruises presenting Hawaii the way Hawaii was meant to be seen. Visiting a total of five ports of call on four islands, the SS Independence and SS Constitution are the only American flag ocean liners operating in the world today. In the tradition of the world's great passenger vessels, they carry their passengers with leisurely grace through the sparkling Hawaiian waters. Originally designed for transatlantic service, they have hosted presidents, royalty, and movie stars. Harking back to the glory days of ocean liners, when interior space was more generous and the service more attentive, the sister ships of American Hawaii cruises treat passengers in the spirit of that bygone era. Under the command of an accomplished captain and friendly American crew, the Independence and Constitution traverse the Hawaiian waters. With the distance between most of the ports covered at night, American Hawaii Cruises delivers its passengers to each island refreshed and ready to enjoy all of its wonders. Our passengers can expect, because we are American owned and operated, that our all American crew are totally dedicated to having our passengers experience the Hawaii folklore and legends. I think what we'd like them to see is evidenced by our interior design, our menus, our entertainment. We know they come to these islands as visitors and we want them to go home as kama'aina. That is what we call the local people here in Hawaii. Much more than furnishings and interior decoration, the friendly aloha spirit so much a part of Hawaii is found throughout the ship. The congenial crew ensures passengers feel right at home. Central to every cruise, the kumu, or Hawaiian teacher, introduces passengers through story dance and song to the legends, history, and culture of the islands. Passengers are enriched in Hawaiian heritage while experiencing its folklore and traditions. From the moment they step aboard, their Hawaiian encounter begins. <laughs> the Hawaiian spirit carries into the shipboard activities. Even the savory food, says Hawaii. Comfortable and relaxed, the ship's dining room features Hawaiian Island, Pacific Rim, and traditional American culinary treats carefully prepared by skilled chefs. While dining room seating at all meals indulges guests with attentive service and splendid menu selections, bountiful buffets, also available for breakfast and lunch, 
encourage guests to dine at their leisure. But whether dining or relaxing, the Hawaiian influence is pervasive. Beyond the Hawaiian experience, the ship's daily schedule is packed with activities designed to entertain and challenge. The morning deck walk signals the beginning of the day's events. An exercise room is available day or night. Passengers can catch a recent film in the movie theater. Or, of course, there is no shortage of quiet places to just kick back and relax. From the moment the ship sails, though, enjoying the spectacle nature has created is all the activity many passengers really need. Home port to American Hawaii cruises, Oahu is a grand beginning for any Hawaiian adventure. The Capital Island is home to Honolulu and a host of famous landmarks. One of the world's best-known stretches of sand, Waikiki Beach, wraps around its southeast rim. World-famous surfing is a key element of the island's lifestyle. Beyond the surf and sand, Oahu opens into a tropical paradise. From Waikiki Beach, Diamond Head rises majestically into the clouds. Oahu is also home to the USS Arizona Memorial, honoring those who perished in the attack on Pearl Harbor. From Oahu, the ships sail to Kona, Hawaii, the first port of call on this Hawaiian adventure. American Hawaii Cruises visits five ports for Elins, leaving from Oahu. We visit the big island of Hawaii, Kona, and then Hilo. This is a very spiritual island with a lot of legends. Maui, which is a place that everyone loves to visit, we spend two whole days in. And then, of course, there's Kauai, the Garden Isle. Back to Oahu, where we say aloha to everyone. As the sun rises on the first morning, the port of Kona appears softly illuminated in the dawning light. The first of the Big Island's two ports of call, Kona is home to clear waters and breathtaking splendor. Both a spiritual and historic center for Hawaii, the city of refuge was once haven for those who broke the law or displeased the rulers until they were granted absolution. From Kona, it's on to Hilo on the Big Island's east coast. The Hilo area embodies Hawaii's tropical climate and volcanic character. Still active, Kilauea continues to change the face of the Big Island. Particularly lovely, the Nani Mau Gardens is an eruption of exotic color.
Known as the home of Old Hawaii, Maui is the next port on the American Hawaii cruise. Once the royal seat of Hawaii's ancient rulers, Maui is full of historical significance. Lahaina, once its capital, eventually became the whaling capital of the world. But it's Maui's natural beauty that dazzles the senses. The fourth island on this Hawaiian voyage is Kauai. At first glance, it is obvious why Kauai is called the Garden Isle. Characterized by stark contrasts, it is home to jagged cliffs pushing thousands of feet into the heavens, as well as Waimea Canyon, the Grand Canyon of the Pacific. Cruise up one of the rivers by boat, or feel like Indiana Jones and paddle up the Hulaia River made famous in the movie Raiders of the Lost Ark. Only by ship can the beauty of the islands truly be captured. Showing guests the islands as the Polynesians first saw them, American Hawaii Cruises presents Hawaii the way it was meant to be seen. 